Hey there, Brian Ewald here at the PRS Factory, and I'm pleased to introduce you today to the brand new Sanzera family of amplifiers. There's three amps in the line. There's a 112 20-watt combo, a 50-watt head, and this here that we're going to look at today is the 50-watt 112 combo. It's got a Celestion V-type speaker in it. It's powered by EL34s. Uh, with 50 watts, it's got plenty of headroom, give you a lot of clean headroom as a, for a great pedal platform. Um, you know, the nice thing with a combo is it's a single grab and go. You can pick it up in one trip and you've got your whole amp if, if you're not into taking a head in a cabinet. But with the 50 watt, you still have as much power as you would have in the head. Uh, and of course, you could pair this with an extension cabinet if you wanted to. Plenty of ins and outs on the back of this if you want to pair it with a, a second cabinet. There's four, eight, and 16 ohm taps. Um, it's a great sounding amp. Super versatile. It's uh, a, even though it has a lot of gain, it's a very, very different voice than the Archon and the two-channel custom. Uh, something brand new to the PRS line. You've got. Two completely separate channels with separate EQ, uh, separate bright switches, even separate reverb knobs for each channel, which is really nice. It's not an all or nothing on either. You can dial your clean tone in really wet and have your lead tone completely dry or with a little reverb. It's a really nice uh, feature. There is a global presence, uh, which is nice to have, which works in the power amp stage. So presence control is always global. A uh, mini toggle in the center that will give you your channel switches or of course it is foot switchable. It's a two function foot switch which will switch the reverb on and off or switch between the channels. It's a, it's a great, great design. A whole new voice for the PRS line. Uh, both the clean channel and the lead channel really sound like they're part of the same amplifier. They don't sound like one clean amp and one totally different voice dirty amp. It sounds like you're playing through the same amp and it's just pushing it and driving it the way a lot of classic vintage amps would feel like. Thank <laughs> you. 